So what am I supposed to do? Thanks. Well, you know, Samuel, once you've crossed that line with her, you can forget about being her minister. I know, Jane, but how am I supposed to deal with my needs? Well, how about outside of the congregation? You know, inside the congregation, we have a special responsibility to the people we serve, and that means that we function in their best interest. Being a minister doesn't give us license to fool around with them, no matter how much some of them may try to convince us otherwise. Yeah, you're right. I knew you'd say that. <laughs> Thanks. Mary came to see me a week later. I thought it was only about her divorce, but she had an additional agenda. Samuel, can we talk about us? Of course. Our dinner together made me realize how I feel about you. Do you know what I mean? I think I do, Mary. I haven't felt close to anyone for a long time. I thought that maybe after last week, you felt the same way. I'm your minister, Mary. Please talk to me as a man, not a minister. I'm lonely, Samuel, and so are you. Mary, I'm sorry, but I can't get involved with you in the way that you would like. If I did, I'd be taking advantage of you, and I'd be no good to you as your pastor. I think I understand. <laughs> 